Hey everyone. Finally, a Black Panther Disney Plus show has finally been announced and it has so much potential. Black Panther will once again take the MCU spotlight thanks to a new Disney Plus show confirmed for development by Marvel Studios. Along with the Dora Malahi's inclusion in the Falcon and the Winter Soldier Disney Plus show has largely highlighted the Black Panther in animation form thanks to the What If animated shows as well. The late Chadwick Boseman delivered his final performance as T'Challa version of Star-Lord in Season 1, and Atana Wakini will give life to the younger version of T'Chaka in Season 2 of the animated show. But from now, we have an official Black Panther-like centric show for Disney Plus finally being announced. According to a Disney Plus press release shared during the world premiere event for What If Season 2, the studio officially announced a new Black Panther centric show for release on Disney Plus from Marvel Studios Animation. The show will be titled Eyes of Wakanda, as confirmed by Marvel Studios head of streaming and television and animation, Brad Winderbaum. The news comes complete with a sizzle reel for the Wakanda-centric show, and the studio also delivered looks at the new X-Men 97 animated show and your now titled Your Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man, the new title for the show formerly known as Spider-Man Freshman Year. We just came out with a video on that. Eyes of Wakanda will feature warriors from the hidden African nation as they go on to search the world for missing Vibramian artifacts that are sure to be dangerous in the wrong hands. As noted in the press release, Eyes of Wakanda was revealed for the very first time tonight. Throughout Wakandan history, brave warriors have been tasked with to travel the world, retrieving dangerous Vibramian artifacts. This is their story. It does seem to be something of an origin story of Wakanda overall, and I keep mentioning finally this is something that's happening because this has been something that's been in the cards for quite some time at this point, something that's been rumored around even. So to see an official like announcement on this is mind-blowing to me. For the time being though, it's unclear if the show is separate from the Wakanda show being developed by Black Panther director Ryan Coogler, which was also initially announced in February of 2021, but I do believe these to be the same thing, actually. This year all being said, looking at the title and the overall official description of Eyes of Wakanda, it appears fans will get the chance to dive deep into the nation's inner workings as its soldiers travel across the world, retrieving and recovering stolen native artifacts. These artifacts are likely similar to the Vibramian weapon Michael B. Jordan's Killmonger and Andy Serkis's Yolsi stole from a museum in London that we see in the Black Panther movie. Movies, with the mysterious metal still being a highly valuable artifact worldwide. It's still unclear whether this will be defensively a canon within the live-action MCU timeline, and if it is, where exactly it takes place during both T'Challa and Shuri's stories in Phase 3 and beyond. Realistically, Eyes of Wakanda could be set in the time of when Wakanda is still completely hidden from the rest of the world, and could easily be set after T'Challa opens the country's borders at the end of the first Black Panther film. Although, as fans wait for more details on the show itself and to the regards of a plot synopsis, with Marvel Studios Animation still working through some other major changes behind closed doors, this show hopes to add a new layer of intrigue to this exciting sector of the Marvel Universe. Eyes of Wakanda is yet to have an official release or in anything officially into those regards. This is just about everything that we know about this upcoming animated show. Of course, guys, I would love to hear all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. What are you guys looking forward to seeing with this show most and the future of the MCU? I would love to hear what you guys are all thinking in the comments down below. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Of course, this has been an official MCU. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great one. Peace out.